In June 2021, the Mobile County JRTC program participated in the sixth JRTC STEM Leadership Academy. The focus of the STEM Leadership Academy is to expose students to career opportunities that exist within Mobile County and the surrounding areas. The theme for this year was career opportunities in the field of aviation. Students took a variety of field trips to include local aviation museums, as well as major aviation industry partners. Cadets also took part in all the great things that JRTC Army programs are expected to do, rappelling, land navigation, ground-proof training, sports and physical fitness activities, and numerous leadership opportunities. While attending the six-day resident camp located on the beautiful campus of Spring Hill College, students were engaged in several challenging STEM projects. As we integrate military disciplines and STEM, students who complete the camp come away feeling confident and have an understanding of what they can accomplish physically as well as possible career choices that may interest them. The JRTC STEM camp is a wonderful addition to what is offered to students in Mobile County. Keeping with our aviation theme, students learned about the history of aircraft by visiting two local museums. First, the Pensacola Naval Aviation Museum at Naval Air Station Pensacola, and the Aviation Pavilion at the USS Alabama Battleship Park. Mobile is home to a robust and thriving aviation community, and students had the opportunity to visit some of the industries located at Berkeley Field. Airbus is a leader in the aviation industry. They opened their doors to allow us to tour their final assembly building, which some of the most modern wide-bodied planes are assembled right here in Mobile, Alabama. Students learn what skill sets it takes to begin a career in the aircraft industry. ST Aerospace Engineering repurposes large passenger jets as well as cargo jets. Our students toured their facility and were exposed to Pacific skilled labor opportunities at this facility. In addition, students went to Mobile Flight Works, a new educational facility with a focus on aviation careers and maintenance opportunities. Continuing with the aviation theme, our cadets learned a lot of principles about aviation and lift. What better way to put this in practice than to fly a kite? Our students visited Dolphin Island where they constructed their own kite and had the opportunity to fly it. During the camp, we had a very dynamic curriculum that focused on several different STEM projects that the students had to execute while at Spring Hill College. The students learned to work together within their platoon and had to meet rigorous course expectations. As a result of funding provided by the National Science Foundation, students had the opportunity to learn how to fly drones. This provided a great opportunity for hands-on learning. A JROTC camp is not complete without unique training opportunities that are Army-centric. While at Dauphin Island, we visited Fort Gaines, where the students learned about this historic facility and the leadership that took place in the American Civil War. One of the activities that the Army expects us to do as part of a normal JRTC Cadet Leadership Challenge is to conduct ground-proof training. Students went to the U.S. Coast Guard Aviation Training Center where they learned how to rescue themselves if they fall into any body of water. Students are taught to use their uniform to create a flotation device. These techniques have saved the lives of sailors and soldiers countless times. One of the more exciting activities is rappelling. Repelling builds self-confidence by having students scale down a tower. It is unnatural to back off of a 45-foot tall platform, but overcoming fear of heights is one of the major outcomes of this training. It's a big boost for cadet self-confidence, and for many cadets, this is one of life's key learning moments. Land navigation is essential for any JROTC cadet. Students learn how to read maps, they learn the different types of terrain, and how to navigate with only a compass. Drill is a fundamental aspect of JROTC. It teaches discipline, leadership, and precision, working together as a team. These skill sets translate easily into life, whether students choose a career in the military or choose to be a civilian.
our charter is to is to make uh, cadets into better citizens. And if they choose to go in the Army, that's a path. But also, a lot of our cadets earn scholarships, go to college, or straight into industry, like uh, working with the industry partners here. Uh, through this whole week for the STEM, lead, STEM leadership camp, uh, a lot of the industry partners have brought kids into the into the factories and workshops and, and, and showing showing the the, uh, the cadets uh, pathways to straight into industry. It's really a great experience and it makes you a better person because like I've said before it builds your leadership skills, helps with teamwork and it really like gets you out of your shell. The STEM camp would not be possible without our sponsors. The National Science Foundation has been our main supporter these past several years. We would like to thank Mobile County Public Schools and its leadership along with our many other partners and sponsors.